Hallelujah! Jesus Christ is Lord. He is risen. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Jesus Christ is the King of Kings. Jesus Christ is the Lord of Lords. Jesus is risen from the dead. Jesus Christ is the only one that can bring you home to heaven. Jesus Christ said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And no man comes to the Father except by me. Hallelujah, he is risen. He is risen indeed, hallelujah. Jesus Christ is Lord. Jesus Christ is King. Jesus Christ is the only mediator between God and man, the man Christ Jesus. Sin came into the world through one man, and through the one man will be all will be made atonement for by Jesus Christ. The only way to heaven is Jesus Christ. If you're walking around today wondering, why am I here? What am I doing here? You need to know that the truth of Jesus Christ will set you free. The gospel is the word of God. The gospel is the truth. The Bible is God's word. It's the truth. The Bible says there were false prophets amongst the people. And there will be false teachers amongst yourselves. They will secretly bring in destructive heresies, even denying the Lord before them, and bring on themselves swift destruction. And many will follow their destructive ways, because of whom the way of truth will be blasphemed. By covetousness, they will exploit you with deceptive words. For a long time their judgment has not been idle, and their destruction does not slumber. Let me tell you today, people, God, there is a judgment coming on false teachings. There is a judgment coming on false teachings. There is a doom. For if God did not spare the angels who sinned, but cast them down to hell, and delivered them into chains of darkness to be reserved for judgment, and did not spare the ancient world, but saved Noah, one of eight people, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood on the world of the ungodly, and turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah to ashes, condemn them to destruction making them an example to those who afterwards lived ungodly and delivered righteous lot from the press by the filthy conduct of the wicked. God saw that Lot was a righteous man and he delivered him. Jesus said, after me there will be false teachers. After me will come false prophets. All the apostles says that if anyone preaches any other gospel, let them be accursed. Let them be accursed. We preach Christ crucified. Jesus Christ was crucified for your sin. Jesus Christ was laid, was dying on that cross. He was bleeding on that cross. And it's because of us. Jesus Christ is the only way to God. God made a blood sacrifice and atonement through the person of Jesus Christ. Through that atonement, we can have eternal life. We can have peace with our Creator. This world will not give you peace. Only the Prince of Peace, Jesus Christ, will give you peace. That's where your peace comes from. The world says, I can give you peace. I can give you meaning. The world doesn't give you meaning. You don't have peace in your heart. So you need peace with God before you can have peace in your heart. The Bible says that God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son that whoever should believe in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Jesus is the only way. Religion will not save you. Religion will not get you into heaven. Philosophy will not save you. Only Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the eternal Word of God, who came down and dwelt amongst us. The Word became flesh dwelt amongst us. Jesus Christ is Lord Jesus Lord is the Lord and Saviour. Do you believe Jesus Christ? Do you believe that he died for you on the cross? Um, yeah. Many people say, I'll tell you what, I'm just saying, the Bible says that Christ is this point here, I'm telling you how to get right with God and why Jesus died. And the reason Jesus died is because Amen. many, many, many years ago in the garden, the name of God did a test for mankind. And he said, there's two trees, you eat from the tree of life, or you eat from the tree of knowledge of good and evil. If you eat from the tree of life, you'll live. If you eat from the tree of 
knowledge of good and evil, you will surely die. And they were tempted by the devil, and they ate of the tree of knowledge of good and evil. And now death has come to this world, and destruction, evil. And Jesus came to fix that mess, and we can only have salvation in Jesus Christ. Yeah, you're right, brother. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, man. Basically, the gospel is good news. I believe, I believe, well, I don't really much, uh, I believe in God, but pretty much uh, Jesus and God, 60%. Well, because uh, uh, God, God is got 99 different names. Well, are you a Muslim? Or? Uh, no, I'm not Muslim, I'm, uh, I'm Christian. Christian, alright, okay. So, it's, uh, many people, they are, uh, they are Muslims, and Christians, and you know, it's low to them. Do you believe that the Muslims and Christians worship the same God? Uh, no, not really. It's just a one. It's only one. It's only one person. Which is good night and different things. It's not only God. It's the one for everybody. Is it Islam that says that God's got night and different Islam that says that? Uh, I'm sure it's Islam, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, if you look at the names in the night of the of Islam, a lot of them refer to him being the lion, or knowing the first and the last. This is what God is known as in the Bible. If you look at the God in the Quran, the God in the Quran doesn't give the salvation, the God in the Quran doesn't give the promise of that people are sure of salvation, and it denies history. The Quran is a denial of history. So when the Quran says Jesus didn't die, he died on the cross, it wasn't from God, but this book says it was. Now this book came 600 years, this, the, the Quran came 600 years after the Bible, and it tells a different message, and it contradicts every prophet in this book. And this is the only book I'll uh, trust. It's, it's only one Quran, what I know. And the Quran is 100 years old. Okay. Is it 100 years? It just came it's in 630. It's 100, 100 years old, and it's only one, one piece. Do you believe in the Quran? Uh, to be honest with you, uh, no, really. I've, uh, I'm believing in uh, God. Because it's only, it's only one. And it's, everybody believes in only one, one person. They can't, they can't just believe. Uh, uh, or they can't just believe, uh, they can't just be Christian or whatever. Uh, how can I explain it? Yeah. Well, Jesus said, do you know John at all, the book of John? Um, John, this is what Jesus says about the truth. Oh. Jesus said, I am the way truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. So Pilate said to Jesus when he was being, before he was crucified, what is truth? What is truth? And he said it, and what was ironic is he was actually looking at the truth when he said it, but he didn't realise it. What is truth? And Jesus clearly says that he is the way the truth. To be honest with you, I don't know about that. Well, what I'm trying to say, uh, obviously I'm believing in God. You're a Christian, you say? He says in the Bible that if anyone preaches any of the gospel other than the one that's preached here, it's a curse. Paul the Apostle says that in the Bible. He says in 1 John 2 22 that anyone who denies the Father and the Son is the spirit of the Antichrist. And I know only one religion that does that in its text, and that's Islam. And anyone else that denies that is the spirit of Antichrist. Because it says that the whole world is under the sway of evil. The spirit of Antichrist is in the world. Jesus says the world that's in you. Because the Spirit of God is greater than the one in the world. So, this place. Nice talking to you. Well, read the Bible. God bless you, mate. Take care. God bless you, bro. Have a good time. God bless you, mate. Take care, mate. God bless you, mate.